Hey folks, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to talk about chipping and what we can do to make it so that we can become a better chipper and get the ball closer to the hole. If you haven't already, remember to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and comment below with any questions and or video ideas you may have. All right, so it's been a while since I have put out a video to talk about chipping and I had a request to talk a little bit more about it. So one of the things that I see with most amateur golfers when it comes to chipping is they make such a short backswing. And what I mean by that is they bring the club back to here and then they try to push the club through the golf ball. When we really need it to be the opposite, right? I wanna feel like whatever I bring it back, I bring it through. So it's almost equal, equal. For now, eventually the backswing will be longer than the follow through it if I had to go further back. But two main points when it comes to chipping. The first thing I need to see is I need to have pressure forward into my left foot and my spine has to be tilted a little bit towards the target to my left. I can't see tilting to the right. I start to create an incline in my shoulders, which now the club starts to work up. I need my spine to tilt forward. Reason being is I need my hands to work down when I chip. That way I can be consistent in my ball striking. The next thing that needs to occur is my left arm stays straight the entire time. It's never bending. My left wrist is never flipping. So the two main points, weight forward, which now that gets my shoulders to go down and my spine to tilt left. My left arm stays straight and I just go back and through. It seems so simple, but if you can start with those two points, weight forward, get the spine tilting left, left arm straight, and I just turn, you'll become a more consistent chipper of the golf ball. All right, so here's a little bit of a down the line view when it comes to chipping. We just talked about the two things we need to do, right? We need to have pressure forward into my left foot, and my spine has to be tilting to the left as a right-handed golfer. When I do that and I keep my left arm straight, I now can become a very consistent chipper of the golf ball and how it comes out in terms of contact. And also I can control the ball a little more once it gets down on the ground. So my spine is tilted forward. You don't see me like this where my shoulders are tilted to the sky. I'm virtually neutral, maybe a one degree to the left. Weights forward, left arm is straight. And I am just chipping the ball onto the green. This makes it very simple to get the ball on the green and close to the hole. 